So I was sitting here watching the Summer Game Fest, and all of a sudden Sonic appeared. What the heck? Zippo was correct. We finally got Sonic 5, and it doesn't look like trash. For those of you who do not know, in our last video, we were talking about rumors and leaks about Sonic, and Sonic 5 was one of the titles. And I think I am like 80% sure this right here, Sonic Superstar, is Sonic 5. Like, I barely almost missed it. But let's, let's just go ahead and watch this. I haven't watched this since yesterday, so let's just, you know, refresh our minds. Okay, let's watch this again. We got the 8-bit. Oh! Look, see, it looks good! Bruh, why are you surprised? You've been in generations. Look at this! I'm getting mega new Super Mario vibes. Sonic is back in a brand new adventure. Like, it's a better Sonic 4. Ooh! Like, it's actually bright and colorful. Ah, crap. Pac-Man World. Jungle Gym. Play as a favorite character. Like, we haven't, been, we haven't been able to play as the boys and Amy in who knows how long. A first ever multiplayer Sonic game. It's been unheard of. And I'm not talking about Olympic games. Wow. Is that allowed? Can they use Pac-Man? Whoa. And apparently there's like chaos abilities or something. Look at this. It's Sonic Mania 2, but in 3D. Wow. I am just really happy. I am just really happy about the multiplayer. Ooh, what the heck was that? <laughs> Sonic Superstore, new thrills, classic feels. Oh crap, man! He's oh, it's coming fall. Is that September or is that October? This game looks worth it. A multiplayer Sonic game has been unheard of since like Sonic Mario Party. I am actually excited for this. But this is not where the video ends, my boys. I have been looking around and I found some other things. Look at this. A dot com. Is this? I know, shocking. Let's read up on it. There's one thing I kind of have a nitpick with this uh, whole game. It's the logo title. What is that? Sonic Superstars? Bruh, is this a Mario game? I am pretty sure there's a Mario game called Superstars. Maybe not, I don't know. But apparently the game revolves around, you know, the constellations and all that. So let's just, you know, read up on it. New Thrills, classic feel. Adventure through the mysterious North Star Islands in this all new take on classic 2D Sonic high speed action platform. Play as Sonic, Tails, Knuckles, Amy, Rose, and harness all new Emerald powers to move and attack. I have been saying this for years. Let the Chaos Emeralds have individual power ups. It makes so much sense. In attack in dynamic new ways, navigate gorgeous and never before seen elements solo up with three other players. That's a smart idea. Now kids can play with other friends with Sonic. It's a no-brainer. Stop Dr. Eggman and Vang in a mysterious new adversary from converting the, I the island's giant animals into badniks before it's too late. I like that. That's it. That's it. It's a really basic and simple Sonic story, and they could surprise us too. Wasn't the wasn't the islands in Sonic Frontiers also named after stars, like Starfall Island or something? I don't know. Next thing, a new spin on classic, the 2D Sonic high-speed and side-scroller action performing, you know and love, reimagined with fully 3D gla gra glasses, graphics, new powers and abilities and new settings, and a new way to play. You never played, you never played Cloud of like this before, son. Honestly, oh, pictures, I didn't know this. That looks good. Yep, that looks fun. Look at this, and I'm not seeing any real errors either. They all look pretty good. It's the classic forms. Was that the blue chaos symbol? It's like ice or something, and they're flying. I'm guessing this is like a special stage. They look good. I like how Amy's a part of the crew. Harness the power of the chaos symbols, swim up waterfalls, change forms, and more with the powers of the chaos symbols. More friends, more fun for the first time ever in a Sonic game. Play through the entire campaign with up to three other players with a drop in and drop out four player local. It's new Super Mario, and I like it. Anyone could just hop in and play. It's smart. Sega, pat yourselves on the back. This is, you guys, not bad. A good 2D game? I'm joking, it's only been two. Oh, pictures, look, look at this. I'm getting sidetracked. This right here? I may use this for the thumbnail. It's pretty clean. We got that, okay, green. Oh, we got sunset now. Is this different levels or is this the same thing? Looks like a different level. Look at this. Are you guys seeing this though? It looks 
good. I've not seen any real ears. Here's the thing though, here's the thing. It doesn't matter how good it looks. It needs to play good. The physics, the momentum needs to feel good. We got Amy with the hammer. Of course, of course. This is a good looking Sonic game. When has Amy ever been playable though? It's been a hot minute. It's just like what, Sonic 06, Sonic Heroes? Welcome back. We got Knuckles flying. Okay, and we're back here. I am excited. But I know there's been some discourse over on Twitter. I know, surprise. And that people are mad that it's $60. $60 for a 2D Sonic game? Dude, Mario does that too. But the most important thing is that if this game is $60, that means it has to have $60 worth of content. So that's why, don't worry. I think this game is gonna deliver. I mean, I don't really know, but it looks good. It, it, and it maybe even plays good. I, like, I'm honestly fine with games costing more money because if it means we're gonna get higher quality games, that's totally fine. Look at this dude, Chaos Emerald. Also, you can like sign up to earn a modern Amy in the game or something. I'll probably do that, you know? Let me do that right now, actually. Don't look at my stuff. Please select the platform you'd like to receive your exclusive crap. What am I gonna play this on? Do I want graphics or do I wanna be able to play it portably? I'm gonna be completely honest with you. It makes more sense to play it portably. I'm gonna get it for the Nintendo Switch. Here's the thing. I'm probably gonna get the game on PS5 just so I can like, you know, record it for the channel in good graphics. All right, guys, what do you guys think? Are you guys excited for this game? Do you guys think it's worth $60 for a 2D Sonic game? Listen, as long as there's enough content I think it is. This game looks honestly pleasing, and uh, and the fact that it's a multiplayer makes the game so much better. I mean, I don't have any friends to play multiplayer with, though, but uh, hey, it gives other people the chance, though, so that's all that matters. It looks like a game that everyone can hop into, and that's that's good. People new and old can jump into this game and enjoy what Sonic is all about. Fast animals destroying robots looking cool. Mario could never. All right, that's enough for me. I'm your boy, Kozen. You guys have yourself a good one. Peace.